Hey everybody, my name is Jay Karchi. I'm the community manager at Bandai Namco Entertainment America, and we are here with... Hi, I'm Carice Lowe. I work at Bandai Namco Entertainment America on the Rise of Incarnates team. And we're here at EVO 2015. We're talking about Rise of Incarnates. Um, what's going on with that game right now? So the game just launched July 1st. It is now available on Steam free to play. We just added a new map, San Francisco, and it's a really cool map where it's basically the Golden Gate Bridge has just been frozen over with the tidal wave and it's a really cool map because it has frozen carrier ships and trucks all over the map that you can use as obstacles and it's it almost gives it a curved dimension because it's a bridge and it's just been broken so it's a really cool map and I hope the players are enjoying it. And we have some new character announcements as well? We do. We just announced a new character, Utsuta Hime. She comes out on the 29th. Her special powers are using ice. She can summon these ice spirits, so she can summon a rabbit, a bear, and a snowman, of course. And her movement around the game, it's almost like she's gliding on ice and skating. And when she transforms into her incarnate, which is Utsuta Hime, she just looks like this beautiful character and really wrecks her opponents using ice shards and she even has an ice parasol that she pierces her enemies with. So we're actually giving incarnate cards to people who play a game, a match of Rise of Incarnates. What these cards do is they'll unlock one of the characters in the game. So the cards we have here today are Lilith, Ares, Mephistopheles, and Grim Reaper. Also, between 12 and 2 p.m. on Friday and Saturday here at EVO, we are inviting people to play the game, bring a friend, play against another team, and the winning team of that match will receive a free Grim Reaper t-shirt. here with Michael Murray, developer of Rise of Incarnates. So what are you seeing at Rise of Incarnates here at EVO? Well, you know, I've been going to EVO for years for Tekken. This is our second year here with uh, Rise of Incarnates. And, uh, you know, we've seen quite a few people play the game. Uh, we see that it really resonates with this audience because it does have some fighting game mechanics, although it's not a fighter. Uh, and people are really kind of intrigued by that, plus that added element of the teamwork that's not present in the other games. So we've had a pretty full booth, uh, people are really excited. Uh, they don't know where to start at first, but we have Daisuke and Jason here to kind of, uh, you know, hold their hand for the first few matches. And then once they get into that, then they seem to be hooked, so I'm right. really relieved to see that everyone's uh, enjoying the game. I've been seeing people play multiple matches here already and they're trying out different characters, which is always an exciting thing to see. Right, I mean because the game is, is it changes completely depending on which character you, you pick because of the strategy, but also which one your partner picks, so uh, I guess people are trying to figure out all the different combinations. So can we anticipate a Team EG rematch here with Justin Wong, K. Brad, PR, Valrog? Well, you know, they have their pride as pro gamers, and uh, yeah, I heard them say that they were going to go home right away and practice, so I think once EVO wraps up, uh, we can see a rematch, perhaps. Yeah, I hope we see that, I'm sure the players would love seeing that. Oh, it was super fast-paced, I loved it. It was just, you feel powerful, you feel like you're working together real hard, and it's just fantastic. And there's a lot of different characters to choose from that have a wide variety of strengths and weaknesses, so what characters were you playing? Oh, the Grim Reaper, I loved it. He's surfing on a giant wave of just zombies, bodies, throwing stuff at people, and just wailing a giant scythe. It was awesome. What did you guys think of the game today? It was cool. It was like pretty combo frenzy. I didn't understand a lot of it until like, I took my time. Yeah. The only thing I did was like, oh, I'm being knocked down, so it's bad for me. And then you have a lot of buttons that combo to themselves. So. Like, that's pretty nice. Yeah, yeah. check on motorcycle, that's pretty OP. What uh, What'd you like about the game? Uh, the character roster and the gameplay is pretty different from any regular fighting game, so that's pretty good. I mean, it's something new and, we, you know, new is better. So Michael, do you have any last words you want to say to our players? Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of people in the booth. Come check it out. Uh, I'll be here, Daisuke will be here. You can fight us or you can fight against our friends. We can teach you the game, have a chance to win a t-shirt. And I think we have some unlock codes as well for customization and such too, right? So Yes, we do. Cool. Check it out. And if you can't come by the booth, uh, the game is free on Steam right now, so download it.
kontor.